Uh, these guys aren't going to be as effective when it comes to it, though. That's the only downfall to this. But, they should be up to the task. I mean, 99 magic defense? Yeah, you're not going to touch her much. And when will the first rave come? It's one out of three, so... Yeah, it's like towards the midpoint of this game. Um, towards the midpoint, there's like four rounds per quest, but then it kind of dips back to three. So let's see, um, 11. All right. Modest uh, increases, but not the best overall, though. I'll still take it, though. I'm not picky. And where will this first wave come? There we go. So Hasty Witch Cult is approaching. Ah, oh, that's nice. So 43 for magic attack. Weak really against physical for the most part. So they should fall down pretty quickly. Wow. Jeez, they never stood a chance. I mean, I was a little hesitant about these guys coming out. I mean... I mean, if anyone... I don't know, neither one of them should be really going out. Because they're success, uh, suspect, skeptical. Whatever. Vulnerable. Let's use that word. That's easier to say, I guess. They're more vulnerable towards the witches. A red wedding party. Alright. Well, if it's witches, um, which it's not, well, for the most part. Oh, boy. Alright. Yeah, you're better off just running. Holy shit! You see all that magic power just going straight towards them? Forget about it. You mind? Here, good. Let's put you towards better use. Oh, and here's the cheap. Oh my god, he's just tanking him like it's nothing. I'm happy I kept this cheap. I mean, you have to have all of them represented. That's how I feel, at least. And I mean, look how well it's worked out so far. I mean, the guy's freaking a powerhouse. I'm quite certain the child's going to be the same way also. And she wants playing cards. I mean, damn. And feasts, offerings. Alright, it's the final round, so let's see. Um, okay, so magic defense, uh, magic attacks is the way to go, and... Boy. Yeah. You didn't stand a chance, my friend. Holy shit. Run. Just run, please. Alright, this is a little messy, but you know what? Our guys have it under control. No casualties from what I saw. Um... I was a little scared for a moment there, because you had, you had quite a nasty trio there. You had the golem, you had the little pirate guy with the axe. And then, let's see what that pirate guy is, actually. So who is this? It's a thief chief. I'll just call him the chief. And that guy is pretty devastating looking. Then we got the giant. Okay, so that's a giant. There's Buster Sword Vongol. <laughs> I mean, you can't tell me that wasn't inspired by Cloud. Or Zack, whoever you're more accustomed to, uh, you know, 
who you're used to. I don't know. Whichever one works for you. Because Zack had the Buster Sword before Cloud, and someone else had the Buster Sword before Zack. I forgot his name, though, but I don't know. That's something I can check on later. When in doubt, Google it. Three oh three grew up. Nice. Oh, and these are rather strong ones too. All right, that's good. Thirty three and okay, so it's very modest increases, but increases nonetheless. So there's some progress. All right, my friend, you need to get some action. You know how you're going to get some action by doing that. And let's get erotic cakes for you in the process. Let's set the mood, uh, the mood a little bit. Some nice clean wallpaper. And how about these guys? How are you guys doing? A cross box? Uh, we're already at that point. Alright, there you go. At least you should be happy now. Oh, it's so crazy. Oh, come on. The child doesn't pay rent. The child does not pay rent. They should not be concerned. Alright, how's everybody's content or feelings for this place? You have been alone for quite some time, so here you go. My gift to you. And soon enough, well, not yet. 101 grew up. You know what that means. So 47. Okay, that's good. 85. Alright, perfect. Not getting nothing. Alright, there we go. It worked out. Yep, expected that. Alright, get back to your room, for God's sakes. That noise is really annoying. There we go. Let's uh, speed that up so I don't have to listen to it. Wow. Alright, that's good. So, 101 has found a lover. Okay, everybody's finding lovers, except Pope the Doctor. He's been left behind here in this love frenzy that's going on here. And, uh, um, let's see, Prisoner's tr Trilemma. Let's uh, teach him a lesson. I'm not afraid of him. Just like with ghosts, I'm not afraid of no ghosts. Nor no prisoner. Screw those guys. There's like three rounds, right? Yep. All right, so we got the fraud squad. <laughs> the fraud squad would actually sound a lot better. The fraud squad. Except it's the fraud fret. So this is gonna be ridiculously easy, except for him. Just take the damage as much as- No, you- it, Why did you- s Okay. Thank God. Alright, if we were going to lose somebody, at least make it someone who's not as important. Because freaking A, that person did not know when to run. I don't think I prevented him from running either. That was that person's fault, not mine. Although I'm not sure if I spent a... Love balloon on him. If that was the case, then I might be a little annoyed. The Torrent Twins. You got 30 years for torrenting. You gotta be kidding me. That's a bit, uh, overreacting, don't you think? Alright, so a high attack, so you know what that means? Well, we could actually use Pop Pio. But. <laughs> They just made that ridiculously easy by giving them 
no defense whatsoever. So I mean, no attack, okay. well, I mean no defense then, you know. Just have a nice tank absorb all the damage while everybody else pounds away at him. That's just way too easy though. I haven't had my fill, man. Where is, uh, where is the last wave? And three, two, one, now. Oh, I got my rent. Oh, there we go, the cannibal crew for life. No, this is gonna be interesting. Let's see, what are these guys like? So, I'll look. oh, it's a troll, it's a troll. They're ninjas in disguise, I know it. Yep. I freaking knew it. And these guys are going to be really... No, run! Don't kill the child, are you serious? What kind of monster are you? Bitch. Oh, that annoys me so much when they target the children. so cheap. I don't, I'm not trying to make a pun out of it, it's, it's really a cheap attack. Yeah, get back home. You must be traumatized after that. Let's see, I guess, I guess if I'm going to end off this session, I'm not sure really how long I am into this, because I did not keep time, keep track of time, whatever. Um, can do Vongol. Can fight him. I do intend on putting this to a close soon, though. Alright, I hope they grow up so badly. I mean, please. Wow. Pyronobia. <laughs> Sounds like a phobia. Alright, let's do Von Gold's answer. I mean, one round, that's quick enough to do. Same goes for the caravan mission also. Do that. Should be one, uh, one round also. So we can mop those up quickly. Now this could be potentially bad. I forget how Von Gold is at this point. Oh, okay. He can, yeah, we can do this easily enough. Yeah, this is gonna be sickingly easy. I'm surprised I'm even, like, I was even worried about that one. Freaking Von Gold, he's always a pushover. He thinks he's tough, but he's not. He's just a jerk. Call him the jerk squad, that makes it sound even better. Alright, let's do this. Impoverished uh, traveler. Ah, oh, you're a daycare worker, that's awesome. Congrats, congrats. And let's raise your rent again to something better than that. Uh, Alright. Alright, everybody's finding a lover. It's a. Uh, Crazy love fest around here. Wow, everybody's starting. Oh my god, I don't like when this happens. Come on, you're a construction foreman and a grave digger. Come on, you can't make a living off that? Oh, this is starting to piss me off, especially with these guys. They're rich. They're fucking rich. Ah, 20 in debt. Now the. This sucks. Now I feel like there's going to be some money problems now. Really have a feeling. Dealer in Nerdco. Alright, what's your posse like this time? Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, this is a good way to go. <laughs> Not even fair to these guys. Are you serious? You ran? Run! What are you doing, my friend? Wow, just let the chief do it. My god. And he's throwing money at that. That's awesome. I mean, really, now, how do you guys feel that a chief just wiped the floor with those guys and you guys just ran? I mean, I'm ashamed. I'm really ashamed, but let's see. Okay, I can understand that. You're pretty weak, but you... You're, you're pretty up there, except for magic. Except for the magic, boy. All right, let's see. We got two more missions left, so let's do vice mail order sales. Great, we have to deal with the customer service reps. I I just love having to deal with them. 